Hey, what's going on, internet? Zyagix here, coming at you with another Mega Man Battle Network 6 video. Last time, Lan and Mick the Dick here uh, returned the penguin that they had, uh, well, that was following Mick around, like a dork. And now we get a free tour of the aquarium, so... Oh, hey, lady. Welcome to the aquarium! Enjoy the world under the sea! Okay, don't tell me what to do. What are you doing here? There's a voice guide at each of the aquarium tanks. You can learn lots of from these these voice guides. Go ahead and tell your friend. It's great. Be sure to do that. Hey, look, a Nautilus. The Nautilus is not only the new kid on the block. Fossil records show that these animals have been on this planet since hundreds of millions of years ago. Who said you didn't learn anything from video games? The crab. The king crab. Even though it's called a king, it's actually closer to a hermit crab. Maybe it thinks of itself too highly. Uh, seahorses? The clone, or, or excuse me, not clone, the Cleone, Clione, I'm not, I'm not sure. Never heard of this one. Is a mollusk, also known as a sea angel. They're floating to and fro with their strange shape. Whoa. Jellyfish? Yeah, the je jellyfish are happily puff puffing around the tank. <laughs> Sometimes a half or the, the half-transparent animals just float around. Probably because they don't have a brain. Hey, did you hear? No matter where you no matter where you get stung by a jellyfish, it hurts! Trust me, I know. Why are you jumping in the jellyfish pool then, you idiot? These piranhas. The piranhas have very sharp pointed triangular teeth. Sometimes a school will eat a whole cow or sheep that happens to fall into a river. Oh, wait, I, I think I'm actually going the wrong way here. I'm supposed to be going around counterclockwise. Fun fact about piranhas, they are actually very skittish. Um, they will not, they don't just attack in a bloodthirsty fashion unless they have been starved to a point where, where they're like, I mean, they just like have had no food. So, really, when you hear about like piranha attacks, that's probably why. It's because they haven't eaten in a while. Uh, I need to go talk to Mick anyway. Hey, Mick! Check out the aquarium. Okay. Alright. Okay. <clears throat> I mean, but it is true though that uh, um, piranhas can actually strip the flesh off in like a matter of seconds because of, I mean, they're just that good. <laughs> Freaking killing stuff. There's a recording thing. They say slow and steady wins the race, and the turtle is no stranger to being steady. This animal has quite a long lifespan. Okay, we got. Tropical fish, like their name suggests, they live in warm water. They like the water around 26 degrees Celsius. And I'm gonna, you know what? I'm already curious. I'm gonna convert that. What is that? Real quick here, da, 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 temperature. 26 Celsius is 78.8 Fahrenheit or 299.1 Kelvin, in case you wanted to know. <laughs> But, um, yeah, that's, that's spelled fairly, that's fairly warm. Uh, same thing. Yep. Uh, then we got... Sunfish are found in warm waters such as the tropics. They say the reason why sunfish are so regionalized is because their tails have become too short. They also look kind of derpy. Like, seriously, look at that face. Derp! <laughs> Alright, so I think we got a little bit more to... Check out here. It's hey, dolphins! Dolphin! You can see dolphins underwater from here. The be er, their beauty makes it easy to lose track of time. They're, I gotta say, I've actually been to SeaWorld and they are very entertaining. Uh, hey, uh, so elephant seal. The elephant seal is the largest body of all seals. The name comes from the fact that the male elephant seals trumpet from their noses and they sound like elephants. Actually, I, it actually sounds a lot more like fart noises. Yeah, just, yeah, that's what they actually sound like. Dolphins are, in actu are actually in, actual ah, in actuality related to whales. Dolphins are less than 12 feet long. Well, anything over that is considered a whale. Hmm. 
Well, actually, that makes sense. I mean, like, uh, if you've ever seen orca whales, they're actually, they kind of look very similar to dolphins. They're just freaking huge. Penguins are birds. However, their wings have become useless for flying and act more like fins. It is possible that they used to fly a long time ago. Plata in there at all? Oh, I don't see Plata. Wait, wait, wait. Something, something doesn't fit here. <laughs> These al uh, the alligator is a reptile that lives on land and in water. Mostly lives in warm tropical areas. You know, usually I don't see alligators or even crocodiles being grouped up with sea animals. I mean, yes, they're aquatic, but I guess maybe that's the similarity there. There are 300 to 400 kinds of sharks in the world. Shark fin soup is a famous food that really has shark's fins in it. Wow! Wow! These are all sorts of things that live in the water. Wow! <laughs> I could stare at them all day. Oh, an announcement. Attention all visitors. The dolphin and seal show will begin shortly. We hope to see you all there. Sounds like there's a show. It might be fun. Let's check it out. I'm guessing it's this way. Welcome to the dolphin and seal show. First, let's bring out our favorite elephant seal, <laughs> Fanny. <laughs> uh... Those of you that don't know, um, I'm pretty sure that's actually another word for one's, uh, one's butt in England. Correct me if I'm wrong. At 12 feet tall and weighing 2 tons, Fanny loves playing with her ball more than her food. I guess you should call her Fatty. Next, let's put our hands together for Finny the Dolphin. Papu Finny? Who knew? There's a Pokemon crossover. Finny is our most popular attraction, and he loves to swim around with a person on his back. That's cool. Hey, Grandpa. This show is totally different from last time, huh? Sure is, Sonny. It was much more of a mess last time. Come to think of it, the trainer's different, too. Trainer? Tapu Fini? It is Pokemon! <laughs> no, it isn't. The last trainer had the dolphin jump through a ring of fire. And the steel lifted weights. What an odd fella he was. I guess that's why he was fired. Frickin' psycho. And now... Let's have someone come and take a ride on Finny's back. Hmm. How about you with the bandana? Would you like to try? Uh, me? Really? There you go. Whoa! Being on his back... is amazing! It's, t it's so cool! Mick, you seeing this? It's not that cool, it's embarrassing. Why? Dude, riding a dolphin would be awesome. And this concludes our show. I hope you had a good time. Come back again. Mick and his frickin' cowlick. <laughs> My name's Mick. I got a cowlick. I don't talk to people with blue bandanas. <laughs> it's about time I go home. Okay, let's go and tell the director that we, we can go see Plata and... No, I want to leave right now. What? You don't want to say goodbye to Plata? Let's just hurry up and get out of here. You, you're afraid that you're going to be sad when you say goodbye to Plata. I'm not a weakling. Who do you think you're talking to? Some guy with a uh, really weird, almost no nose. I mean, seriously, if you look at his chat hat, he lo almost looks like he doesn't have a nose. I'm the guy who's going to crush you in a net battle. I know, I know. You don't have to keep on reminding me. All right, let's go home. Okay, I'm gonna actually go. Is there something else here, maybe? Um, doesn't appear so. Not born soldier. People like to eat. Well, it's well, yeah, good to know. Let me guess. Something else is gonna happen here before we get to go home. This is the area you used to breed large animals that live in the water. It's filled with rarely seen animals. Yeah, 
quite sure about that. Hey, fish! There's nothing to examine. I guess we're going home now. Doo -doo. Aha! I figured something would happen. He's back! Har har. How was he show me these? I was watching from the shadows. That wasn't entertainment. I'll show him what real entertainment is. Her <laughs> her. Who's this fart rocker? Nick, what's up? Ah, uh, nothing. Well, off to uh, go home. Uh oh, another cutscene. You really okay with not, with not saying goodbye to Plata? Stop already! I don't need to say this some special goodbye. Eek. Whoa! Uh oh, it's Piranha 3D all over again. There are piranhas on the fountain! Ah! Stay out of the water. Whatever you do, stay out of the water. And, okay, and I guess it's Piranha and, oh my god, Piranha versus Sharknado. <sighs> this is terrible! The aquarium tanks and cages all just unlocked themselves! And all the fish and animals have escaped! The aquarium is connected to the town's water system! Everyone, stay away from the water! Yeah, it sure does sound kind of like the plot of Piranha. This is bad. That aquarium had alligators too, remember? They escaped into town. Honestly, you probably that's your least of your worries. They, they're pretty stupid. When they get on land, they're pretty slow. The penguin, is he alright? Aw, Mick, you do care! I'm gonna go check it out. Hey, wait up. It's too dangerous to go alone by yourself. Take this! Da -na -na -na. <laughs> Yet again, another crossover made. Legend of Zelda. Land, we should go back to the aquarium too. This wasn't an accident. I'm sure someone caused this. Yeah, I know. Let's go. We gotta catch up with Mick. Yeah, strangely enough, I mean, as much as I, as much as I know about Piranha, I honestly cannot stand horror movies. I'm just, uh, uh. I'm just, uh, it's just, I don't know. It, it really. I guess I'm one of those people that just can't handle them. Sir, even in an emergency situation, the area over there is for employees only. This is awful, terrible even. Okay. When a turtle comes out of water, it looks like a rock. Um, okay. Don't go that way. Another bird. Ah! Okay. Whoops. Hey, what happened to the jo- Oh, lord. Jellyfish are gone too. But surprisingly, these guys are, are fine. Uh, Mick, where'd you go? Well, that was that was easy. Ah! Well, we found Plata. Mick, what are you doing? Get out of there! You idiot! If I don't do this, who's gonna protect these penguins? Mick. You darn I have to do something. Hey! Uh-oh, he's... Whoa! He's kind of stuck, too. Not the, the uh, aquarium director? Yes, yes it is. Oh, it's you! The boy who brought Brandon back, right? I think that's the wrong voice from him. What happened? This what does it look like! They locked, they locked and locked themselves! Something must have happened in the control room! It's backstage, the main computer in that room controls everything in this aquarium. Of course, that includes the cage and tank locks. But it's dangerous. Here, please save yourself. How can I help? There's got to be a way to fix this. There's one way. First, you must normalize the main computer. Then, using the main computer, broadcast the feeding time chime at top volume. The fish and animals here are trained to return to tanks and cages whenever they hear that. I can do some feeding time myself. <laughs> If you do that, maybe just... I understand. First, I gotta find a way to fix the main computer. Hang on, Mick. You too, penguins. I'm gonna find a way to fix this. All right, here we go. 
What? Ah, uh, what's here? Ah! You see the door there? I bet that's the entrance to the control room. But that seal doesn't look like he's gonna move. So we can't keep going. We don't have time for this. What should we do? Man, remember the show? Trainer, what did she say? Fanny the elephant seal loves playing with a ball more than food. So we should try to find a ball with her to play, play with. Let's hurry up and find one. They used one of the show. It must be around here. Um, probably, uh, definitely, yeah. Don't go near the jellyfish. Uh-oh. Way over there. There it is. The seal's favorite ball. Okay, I'm going in to get it. Wait, Land! What's wrong, Mega Man? Why are you stopping me? The tank is full of jellyfish, and the jellyfish are poisonous. If you get stung in the tank of this deep, you'll drown. It doesn't matter right now. While they're, while they're talking about this, Mick and the others... Calm down, Lan. Slow down and talk rationally about this. Now, how can we swim through the water and not get stung? Without getting stung? Is there a way? I don't... I mean, is there like a diving suit somewhere? Maybe. I don't know. Maybe go... I'm gonna have to go look. Hmm. Hey, it's you again. That girl, why is she here? Um, she a ghost? She's get what the heck? Huh? What? She was just here. What? And she's going, hey, wait up, you! And she's gone. <sighs> Not here. Where'd she go? Oh well, better go back. Ah! How the hell did you get up there? What is she doing there? Hey, you, what are you doing up there? What? Is she what is she pointing at something? She's telling me to go over there? Chomp. Oh the friggin' piranhas are going nuts. And gone again. Oh wait. She just disappeared. Just who is that girl? Okay, so there's something out. So it's not in the actual aquarium. It's gotta be somewhere out here. It's supposed to be pointing me to something. Ah! Oh, a copy bot! Why is there a copy bot here? And isn't this the one from school? Land, this is it! What do you mean, Mega Man? If you transfer me into this copy bot, then it doesn't matter if I get stung and I can swim freely. We can get the seal's ball that way. You're right. This is the answer. That mysterious girl, did she come to help us out? Alright, in you go, Mega Man. Transfer complete. Alright, let's do this! Alright, Mega Man's in the pool. Got the ball. Alright. Mega Man! Land! Donkey! <laughs> wow. Looks like you got it. How do you feel? I'm okay. Copy Bot's battery is almost out, though. Gotcha. Transfer back to the PET then. Hooray. Ugh. Now with a ball, Mega Man. Uh, I'll. I'll move the seal out of the way. Alright, here's your frickin' ball. Um, this seal's name is, uh, Fanny, I think. Hey, Fanny, look over here! It's your favorite ball! Ooh. Oh, she responded. Okay, Fanny, I'm gonna roll this ball over here. If you want it, you're gonna have to go get it. Look! Oh, oh, oh! Go get it. I just love how they just bounce like two inches off the ground like that. Yeah, right. We did it. Now we can keep going. 
control room is beyond this door. We've got to hurry. Uh, Mick and the others are in danger. Well, yeah, we'll keep going here in the next episode because I'm going to have to go ahead and stop here, guys. So if you guys like this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. We'll be seeing you all in the next video. So thank you very much for watching. God bless you all. See you in the next one.